I just happened to have my first day right here. This is uh, the time book from 1966. And my first fire, my first day in fact, uh, I had an acting sergeant in charge. His name was Ed Smith. And he was from uh, Engine 40. And the rest of my crew was Rudy Wagner, Sergi Ferresi, John Lissick, and Danny Jesuits. I remember he was a cook. He was the one that got me in the big trouble. That was my first day. And my first fire was that afternoon, a trash fire on the junction in the freeway, right around the corner. So, so that was- Who was your senior man? Usually. Rudy Wagner. And it was funny then because uh, all the, uh, a lot of the firefighters had 25 years on, and they're still firefighters. So, you know, they're naturally they're upset. They're mopping the floor in donuts. I remember mopping the floor two or three times a day. I remember this one guy bitching all the time. Yeah, I know what the hell he's, you know, the floor downstairs, it never looks clean anyway. So we're mopping it. I'm thinking, it takes us 10 minutes to mop the floor. Why is he so upset? Well, later on, I found out he had 25 years on. He's still mopping the floor. So that was that. And uh, another thing, uh, uh, Sergi Fressi on the hockey team. I had a trial and I made the hockey team as a trial man. And uh, I had orders. Our chief of department, Charles Quinlan, was a great guy, avid hockey fan. We played at Windsor Arena. And uh, as a trial man, I got orders to get out for games and practice. I didn't realize it till later how much it upset everybody that me as a trial man are leaving at 10 in the morning for practice on practice days. And at the games, somebody picking me up at 8 o'clock at night and getting back at midnight. I just thought it was part of the job, so it took me a while to figure out why everybody hated me. So how was the, the competitiveness back then? as far as like getting first versus track. Crazy, crazy. We had an engineer here named Leo Gaines, one of the top engineers. It seems like we're continually racing other companies, continually. <coughs> then when I went to Engine 12, probably the best engineer of all time was uh, Jack Van Team. they called him the king. And uh, it was a double company there, Engine 12, Ladder 9, and we were never second anywhere. If you didn't get on the rig, you're standing there. And I made the mistake of saying one time, you'll never leave me. Well, we had the covered wagons with the tailgate in the back. He just jumped on the back. Well, as I was upstairs in the second floor bathroom one time, I heard the alert go off. I'm running, trying to get my pants on. By the time I hit the apparatus room floor, the other deck in the back was just going like this. Oh, they, they, they ragged me for months over that. I never, never missed a rig again. It was pretty funny. <laughs>